Hey guys, in this video I will be showing you how to install WordPress locally on your Mac. I will be showing you from the very beginning how to do this, so if you're coming from my previous video you'll want to skip ahead to the 37 second mark. So the first step is to open a web browser on your Mac and search for WordPress Bitnami download. Click on the first result, scroll to the bottom of the page, and click on the download for OS X button. From the pop-up, click on no thanks, just take me to the download, and WordPress will start downloading on your Mac. Once the download finishes, click on the download to open it. Now simply drag WordPress to the Applications folder, and then click on Authenticate from the pop-up. WordPress will now begin installing on your Mac. Once the installation finishes, Open Launchpad and then click on the WordPress application to open it. From the warning pop-up, click on Open. Now you will see the home screen of the WordPress Bitnami app. From here, click on the Start button. Now wait for around 60 seconds for the WordPress app to set up your WordPress website. Once the app has set up your website, you will see the status change to green. So after seeing the green status, click on the Services tab and make sure all three services listed are green. If they are not green, click on the Start All button to turn them on. Now click on the General tab and then click on the Go to Application button. Your local WordPress website will now open in a web browser. Click on the Manage option from the bottom right corner and you will land on this page. The page will display your WordPress username and password, which are set to User and Bitnami by default. You will probably want to change the password, so click on the login link. Enter in the username and password to log into WordPress. To change the WordPress password, click on Users from the left menu, then click on User, scroll down and then click on Generate Password. Now in this text box, you can enter in whatever password you want. Just make sure to note down the password. After entering in your password, click on the Update Profile option. And that said, WordPress has been successfully installed on your Mac. A shortcut to log into WordPress is just entering in slash login after the IP address of your website. Now that you have WordPress locally installed on your Mac, you may want to watch the video on the right side of your screen to learn how to transfer your WordPress website from your Mac computer to a live server. If this video helped you out, hit the subscribe button to stay tuned for more videos like this.